Good evening, viewers, and welcome to the studio of Platform Media International, PMI. I'm your host, Big Rich. This is another episode of What's Up with Big Rich on PMI. Today, we are about to uh, discuss the topic, time. How important is your time? There's a saying that goes, time is life, time is money. Is that true? Today with me in studio, I have my very good friend, Mr. Shaq. Hey. Mr. Shaq, welcome to PMI. Welcome, my big great. So, um, it's all about time today. Time is life, especially in the Western where you know that time is everything. You go to work, you go to work on time. Seven to three, you clock out. If you have another job, you go there. But is that all to life? Because there is more to time than just going to work and clocking out and clocking in. How important? It's time to us, to African, because we, African, <laughs> we are people who don't value time, so, slow to speak. But how, how important is it in the first place, time? Well, thank you, Big Rich. Um, to me, my definition of time have a very different way in which I will say time is all about life. That's right. And uh, when I say time is all about life, when we wake up in the morning and we look at the time, that's what I call life. Because every minute that the time clicks, mm -hmm. like for instance, when you look back, when Queen Elizabeth wanted to die, she said, I will give one all my treasure out for just one day. Why do wow. you think she said that? Because she believed Living in this world, it's more important. Hmm. We can work and get this money. We can work and work and get millions of money. Yeah. And we can save it or we can use it, but we cannot do with time. We cannot say, I'm going to hold time mm -hmm. for me. Yeah. We cannot say, I'm going to work and then all what I do is the time will stop for me to do what I want to do. No. That's right. We have to cherish every moment we have. Mm -hmm. Every blessed moment we have, we have to cherish it. That's Why? Right. Because if we go down and I ask myself, in life, if you look at it, for example, I will give an example. Yeah. You go to the bank mm -hmm. and the bank gives you $84,600 and the banks want you to finish that money in a day. That's a lot That's of money. money. <laughs> but the the catch in this is that mm -hmm. if you don't finish that money, mm -hmm. the bank is going to take the rest one that you have. So what are you wow. going to do? You are going to spend every money wisely. Yeah. You're going to spend it because you know it is important. Yeah. Okay, it's the same thing. God has given us every blessed day. We have 86,400 seconds in every day of our lives. Wow. So why don't we use this time value? Because if you don't use it value... No matter, at the end of the day, mm -hmm. whether you like it or not, what you do or what you don't do, it's over. It's over, yeah. Either you use your time wisely by encouraging people. Yeah. Because if we think about just money, mm -hmm. where are we going to go with the money? Yeah. Nobody has ever gone with the money to another world. To another when world. When you're gone, it's over. It's over. But the, what you do behind, the memories you leave behind, mm -hmm. it's very important. Yeah. So, um... We talk about time. Yeah. So we talk about time, life, not just working, yeah. but also talk about time with family. Yes. And sometimes you want to get up in the uh, morning to go to your work, mm. and it's 7 o'clock, mm. and the alarm rings. Yeah. You press the alarm. Mm. Even you take off the battery. Yeah. The time is not waiting. The time is going. Yes. So sometimes people, a lot of us spend... Uh, people uh, are, are time just focusing on work and then but we have family yeah. and we have the kids and, You know if you are dad you need time with your family as well. You need the time to raise your kid So how important time as we already talked about time you know our work, but how yeah. important is time with family? Well, big rich uh, time with family mm -hmm. is one of the amazing things 
For instance, uh, if I have I have learned to learn from my experience yeah. that I, I have a son mm -hmm. who, um, who have to go to school and mm -hmm. he's doing special thing at school mm. and uh, I have to go by 8 o'clock there sharp and I'm working on set mm -hmm. and as I'm working, there is no way I can leave set also in camp. And, but at the end of the day, when I go home and I looked at my, my son mm -hmm. and he looks at me, I feel so guilty. so guilty. I cannot catch back that time no, that I, I did not be at that the moment he needed he me. Needed me. So needed sometimes I ask myself, well, time and money, money and time. But which one are we taking? Because it's something we have to deal with, but time with our family is priceless. It's priceless. And when you don't go to so you when you don't go to things that your son asks you to do or you have an appointment and you don't go and regarding to your family or your son trust me after the day's work you feel guilty you feel guilty wow so with family it is really important yeah so viewers out there time with family is very important you might work and make all the money back buy the biggest of our house out there and um you don't spend time with your family. You are wasting the, uh, the, 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 the memories that you're supposed to build with them. Uh, there's a story about a guy who worked and worked and gave his family everything, but his kids were growing up and he wasn't spending time and the mother alone cannot raise the kids by herself. And the kids turn out to be the worst. But with all the resources you are provide, provide food, food and everything, but you're present. Your person taking them to their games, to 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 their ballet classes. If you have a daughter, everything that has to do with upbringing of your kids require time. And if you can spend that time, just how you spend that time at your work, you have to also spend that time with your family as well. So, Mr. Prince, um, and we talk about time being life. We talk about Queen Elizabeth wanting to live just for another day because how important time is with uh, 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 to, uh, well, to her, right? Yeah. So what's about time with who we spend that with, with the uh, exclusion of our family? Sometimes we spend time with people who don't deserve that time. What am I saying? You okay. spend time with people who have uh, negativity, people who drain you dry. Is it worth it to spend time with those people? And if so, how should we avoid them not to be drained? Yeah, um, Big great. just a very interesting topic. You know, most of the time you need to understand life is met with two different ways, positive and negative. And being... In every day of your life, you have to understand if you meet a positive man, mm -hmm. is it important? Yeah. You meet a negative man, it's also important. Yeah. Why did I say both of them are important? Because one yeah. will teach you a lesson mm -hmm. and one you will learn from it. Okay, now this is what happened with people. People who drains you completely. Why yeah. would they drain you? Because they believe that what you have in there is so important, they have to take it all yeah. and make you the same way they are. Yeah. But okay, this is what you are going to do. Mm -hmm. Because you learn from them and you become one step ahead from them. Uh, yeah, right. And you become more smarter than them. So you don't you don't believe one thing I say in life is that no matter when I see somebody who is really, really not get into my taste like mm. not get into the way what, what i want mm. what i do is i cut him off cut him off yeah. why do i cut him off because he's going to drag me astray doesn't worth your time he doesn't worth my time yeah. and every minute i spend is important it's to important. me because the people i meet if i meet you today and i say hey big rich how are you doing today fine mm. oh prince um i got something to do i want us to give me a helping hand i have spent that five seconds five minutes we had mm. it's important to me but if I meet you and you say, oh, Prince, today I don't feel like doing anything. Let's go party. Let's go have fun. Yeah. When I know there's a lot of things to do, I know you're wasting my time. So even the Bible says, mm -hmm. it said, when this sign is not good for you, what do you do? Chop it off. Chop it off. Just chop it off. And that's it. That's right. So I will spend my time with people who respect my time, people who have value for me. Mm -hmm. And I have value for them because these are the memories and these are the things that will make me happy in life because I will not get back to get those time again every right. day as i say 
eighty six thousand four hundred seconds yeah. every day counts. Counts. Yeah. Like Oprah, you know, said, keep those in your circle who have add value to your life. Yes. Because if you waste up the time, you're wasting your life with them. Yes. So it's very important as well. But also, it is also important to not spend your time living for yourself. Yes. It's also important to spend your time living for people. Yes. What am I trying to say? Doing good, spending your time reaching out. Yes. I know you do some uh, charity work back home as well. Yes. You also spend your time going back home to these kids mm -hmm. and, you know, sharing with them. Yeah. Uh, uh, how important is it when you do that, the feeling you get in return? You don't get anything from them. You don't get money from them. You don't, do, you don't, you don't get money from what you're doing. But that time that you sacrifice to do that, how important, how do you feel when you, when you make that sacrifice? It is, it is funny you brought out this topic because, sir, um, I was in the midst of helping a lot of kids like every year mm -hmm. once the container send the clothes and all this thing mm -hmm. and the girl came out out of the mist the little mm -hmm. girl like she's just 10 years old and she looked at me and i i always tell them if anybody have any question mm -hmm. they should feel proud bold enough to ask me yeah. i am not going to do anything to them it's <laughs> they are welcome yeah. so this little girl asked for a microphone and mm -hmm. they give her a mic mm -hmm. and he said brother prince i'd like to ask you a question why do you give us all these things why? wow and to my surprise, <laughs> like everybody stopped what they were doing mm -hmm. and they want to listen to what I will say. say. And do you know what I said to her? What did you say? I said, a name is, uh, what's the name? A name is Kedisha, Kedisha, Kedit. I said, look, it's not because I have a lot oh. of money. Mm -hmm. It's because I know what it takes when you don't have it at all. Oh, trust so, me. I know in back home, a lot of people are here, they think uh, Africa is blessed, Africa have everything, Africa. Look, the truth fact is that most of these things that people send to Africa, mm -hmm. Africans don't receive it. Not at all. That's why I go myself. Mm -hmm. They said when you want to help somebody, to feed somebody, yeah. don't always go and give them the fish to eat, yeah. but teach, teach them, them how to fish, how to fish and yeah. then they will fish for themselves, for themselves. without you being dead. Yeah. It's a, the, there's a saying that it's better mm -hmm. to, to, to travel, to, 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 it's better to know more about the role mm -hmm. by traveling it mm -hmm. than by consulting all the maps in the world. Yes. So when you've you been there, seeing a look on the kids, uh, the, the, you know, the children's faces, it's priceless. You cannot yes. uh, get, get that any better. And um, also, um, with that, I also sponsor a little girl from, from like, virtual uh, playing Canada. Mm -hmm. I walk in the mall and I saw, you know, the pictures of these kids. And I've been there before. I've been back home. I just came here 2004. Mm -hmm. And I, I, know, I know how hard it is to not have, or your parents don't have money to send you to school. So I saw the picture and I, I just, you know, I'm like, you know, this is just $40 a month. I can take my kids to my donor and I can blow this in a second. Yeah. I will use this money to change somebody else's life. Yeah. So if that girl continues sponsoring that girl, if she becomes somebody, I've spent my life making somebody else's life better. And when you live knowing that you did good to other people and you changed their life and, that, and they also in turn changed their family's life, yeah. you have a purpose of living. Yes. And that's very important. Yeah. So that's what it is it's all about. So Mr. Prince, I also have my final uh, uh, topic here. It's also talk about um, if you do not manage your time well, mm -hmm. you find out that you, you get more stressful then when you manage your time do you want to elaborate on that a little bit yeah um i think when you have everything yeah and you do everything right mm -hmm. and you spend your time going to volunteer like for instance i walk in canada here and i see pensioners mm -hmm. old men or old women they take these flags to stop the traffic to let people pass Nobody pays them. Yeah. It's volunteer. Yeah. What they are doing is priceless. Mm -hmm. Like all what we have to do, 
Sometimes you honor them, you say, you oh, wind down your window and yeah. say good morning. Yeah. You're walking by the street, they stop and make you cross. Just give them a big hug. That's right. Canadian is all about love. Mm -hmm. Just give people love. Just make sure every day of yeah. your life, the 86,400 seconds you got every day, yeah. hug somebody. Yeah. Tell somebody how wonderfully mm -hmm. they are made. Yeah, man. Tell somebody... <laughs> Time is important. It's important. And this very moment I see you and you see me and I'm hugging you. Yeah. It means a lot to a me. A lot of time. Yeah. A lot of time. So yeah. all what I'm asking is that let's show more love to the yeah. people who give themselves. Mm. Like people donate their time in the morning. Yeah. Even if it's raining, they stand there with the flag, stopping for children to cross. Yeah. These children, let people hug them. These people, yeah. hug them, tell them how much you, you, you care. Appreciate you them, appreciate maybe. them. That's right. You know, Appreciation is everything. Blessing. It's so, all about blessing. That's right. So viewers, do you want to know why you stress? Because you're not managing your time well. If you manage your time, you would not be stressed. I go through this with my wife most of the time. We're getting prepared for service in the morning, and it's 9 o'clock. We're supposed to be leaving at 9.30, and she's just getting ready by 9.45 or 9.30. You find out that there's so much rush, there is so much stress. That's just a simple example, but she knows that I love her anyways. But if you want to live your life less stressful, try and manage your time. Don't live for yourself. Try and live for other people. Be kind to people. Yeah. Those out there that are volunteering their time to the service or, or, or to the, the NGOs and, and, and other communities. Yeah. He volunteered his time to go every year to Africa to please these kids. Is the reason why we should live. Living for people yeah. and valuing our time. I want to tell you, thank you viewers for listening. And I hope you got something from this uh, beautiful message that we just discussed. Make sure to tune into Platform Media every week. Click the like button, subscribe to the YouTube channel, and also go on to the website of Platform Media International. I want to tell you thanks for coming, Mr. Shaq, and thank, thank you, you viewers. Much. Have a good night. Thank you very much. Yeah.